Hello guys, today we will show you how to hack your PSP very simply with the custom firmware Pro uh, C6.61 through your memory stick. Simply, first you connect your PSP memory stick to your PSP. Then connect your PSP with this cable to your PC. Then it opens automatically. I will open it manually. <coughs> you go into the computer. PS Memo is my PSP, so open it. This is a step one. Very simple. Step two Download Pro CF3 6.61 hack. 6.61. Uh, hack allows you to play PlayStation 1, PSP games, of course, uh, Game Boy, Nintendo 64, Nintendo 64, uh, sorry. <laughs> Not bad. Uh, what else? Uh, SNES. So this time you will download the hack 6.61 Pro CF3. Click it and waiting for this download. The hack is downloaded. Open it and put the PSP folder. In the desktop. Step two is done. Now we are going to step three. Step three is about the update. Update allows you to play in version 6.61. If you have 6.35 version, you have to update it to 6.61. If you already have 6.61 update, you don't have to update it. Very simple. Now we are going to agree with the terms and the conditions and to download PSP Cross 3.0 download as you can see it's downloading right there and now we are waiting Come on, done. Now, as you can see, it's an input file. So, what do we have to do? All we have to do is to open the file, put it in the desktop again with the PSP, and now we will put the input file into PSP, click game, and win. We will Create a folder named update. Open it and put the eboot file there. Rename it to eboot only. Click enter. Cross. Now we are done. Let's put it in our PSP. It's already connected. Go to the computer your PSP and put the PSP folder in there now we are done with the part of the update and the hack So now we'll show you how to play games, PSP games and PS1 games and what is the difference. PSP, one, uh, PSP games, we will reload it in the folder named ISO. 
if it's in the PSP ISO, only ISO, only, you will put it in a fold named ISO out of the PSP folder. This is very important. If it is a PS1 game, like Tekken 3, Dino Crisis, or whatever you, you, what you want, you will put it in a PSP directory, game again, and put it in this one folder because it's a need because it's an eboot file again as you can see eboot file is a taken three and eboot file is the update come on so put the taken three in this folder and now we're waiting for this to done until done So now when it finishes, we will be ready to test it in our PSP. Come on. Now we are done, as you can see. Let's test it in our PSP. Let's go. Let's do our final step. Our final step. Open it. My version is already in 6.61, so I don't have to update it. If you have an older version, then you have to do it. This is the update version 6.61. And go to the Pro Update and click X. Wait. Now as you can see, probably you don't, whatever, you press X and again X, it's, and it's done. This is the hack, so simple, two cross, and you have your PSP hacked. And I will play Need for Speed Most Wanted. You see, it works. And you don't have to pay a Sony, Nintendo, whatever you... Xbox. Yes, I don't want. And this is it. Thank you for watching me again one more time and for more videos subscribe and like and see your opinion say your opinion about your whatever whatever you want and I will show it in my next bit thank you for watching one more time Golf GTI, Golbat, uh, Cobalt SS, and Mazda 3. Always I will choose Golf. Yes. And as you can see, it's completely runs. So thank you for watching.